What is up everybody? It's Marts here from Section Store once again. Today we're going to be having a look at this tab section right here. You can either use it as an FAQ or just showcase what features your product has. And I'm going to show you the functionalities of the whole thing. And I will also show you what we're going to do in this video because we will use it for a store I'm owning myself. It's this Blue God store. It's a little screen protection for your phone. So it's better than the usual Apple Night Shift and we're gonna build our own. So we're gonna end up with this at the end. But I'll just say we jump right into it. The app I'm gonna be using for this is called Section Store. It's a component library which has over 100 fully customizable Shopify components and they either come with a little charge or are completely free as well. But it definitely saves you a lot of time and money for a developer and you won't need any code at all. So that's good for non-techies, so yeah. I just say we get straight into it after downloading the app. We head back to the Shopify admin area. That's where you want to be looking for section store and then click on explore sections right here. And here you want to type in tabs. Like I said already, they either come completely free, but this is one of our more complex sections. So it's a one-time charge of $9. So that means if you bought it once, you're going to own it forever. And there are no hidden subscription fees or anything whatsoever. So yeah, after you've done so, you just have to head here and install it to the theme you're using. In my case, it's the Streamline theme. And after you've done so, you can easily head in the theme editor and open it up right here. That's the one I showed you already. So we just kind of get rid of that. And I'm going to show you some simple things and how you can also add it. Like I said already, the whole thing is fully customizable. And I'm going to show you what I mean with that. So if we click on the main thing, first thing we can do is change this little headline right here. Change the screen color. Super generic text, I know, but at the end it's up to you. What do you want to put in there? I'm happy with frequently asked questions. I'm just going to leave that like this, but I um, wanted to show you that all of this is fully customizable, so you can adjust everything right here. And that's one important thing right here. We can select a main image. So maybe I'm just going to put this phone right here. I'm going to use the other one anyways in a second. And here we can change some stuff as well, like some mobile settings. If we scroll all the way down, we get some more stuff. So here we have the, the arrow color as well, which is that right here. And the question color, the icon width. Maybe you want to have it a little bit smaller so it looks more subtle. Let's just put it to 30 maybe. I think that looks good. The answer color is changeable as well. And all of those, those, those things and the paddings to the side are changeable as well. And one more thing that is important, I'm going to switch back to the desktop one so you can see it better. We change that right here. You can simply just change it to whatever you prefer to and what kind of fits the vibe of your brand. Yeah, that's something we can change as well. The icon color and we can decide in a number of different ones right here what icon we want or we can upload our own icons a really good library for that is the bootstrap icon library i can put the link in the description of the video and if you're not happy with the ones we put already just pick there Alrighty, that looks fine to me and the other thing which is possible here is changing the question of course available worldwide and we get the answer as well yes it is and that is pretty much it I think I'm just gonna show you the other one again I showed you in the beginning of the video so you can see I put the icon color as that connect with us on social media always and we're gonna save it all up and have a look at it in the live version which is that one I'm going to give it a little reload and then we're pretty much finished already. I think that should cover everything which that section has to offer and let's have a look at it. That looks sweet. I think I'm also changed was the little border above the questions here. But yeah, 
you saw all the customization options and I'm sure you're gonna find even more. The section is pretty much a good banger. So yeah, I'm hoping you're happy with that. And if you are, you can always leave a like or a follow. Definitely helps us to keep up that motivation. And with that being said, have a good one guys and peace out.